Hey friends, we are back at it again. What are we up to? We are at SLXCA for 2023. Let's do this! I'm Courtney. I am in my fourth year out of five at the University of Waterloo studying physics. I'm Tina. I'm also in my fourth year out of five at Waterloo studying nanotechnology engineering. So the She Look Leader program is an amazing program. It offers a scholarship to fund most of the university, but most importantly, it offers, offers you so many opportunities. It opens so many doors. We have David Goodman, who is the most fantastic person. So excited to welcome all returning and you She Look Leaders together, connect and inspire one another for another year ahead. I'm thrilled, first and foremost, to celebrate the outstanding achievements of you, um, so many talented students in science, ecology, engineering, and mathematics. My name is Abhi Gotra, I'm the CTO and co-founder of Altex. What we're doing is we're taking one of the world's largest landfill contributors, which is moon waste, and then engineering it into a biodegradable, carbon-neutral alternative to polyester, but specifically designed for the fashion industry. Being a shoe look leader is, on paper, it is a scholarship, for people who want to go into entrepreneurship, business within STEM. In practicality, it's so much more than just a scholarship. It's a network of amazing, like-minded people. It's providing me so many friendships, relationships I wouldn't have had otherwise. And you connect with people all over Canada. My lovely friend behind the camera is someone I met uh, also in my I <laughs> Stop it. We agree with Courtney with how the, the Shulik Network is a bunch of people, um, like young, new, talented people who are specifically in STEM, um, who are super passionate about using whatever talents they have to come together, collaborate, and make something amazing. And uh, any advice to any aspiring Shulik leaders? Yourself. A lot of people think to do a certain thing for an application and it looks good on an application. The best thing on an application is something you're passionate about and show dedication to. I did news, I did news, I did theater all of high school. I was a director. On paper, why is that going to get me a STEM scholarship? It shows that I'm dedicated and I'm really passionate about something. So follow your passions and use that to your advantage. I would say like the best quality of a shoe leaf leader is someone that like um, will continue to pursue new opportunities and like use their talents to kind of help make the world a better place, whether or not they have like a scholarship or you know that extra factor that helps motivate them. Thank you everyone, Shulik leaders, we meet again. I don't say that as being my adversaries, I'm actually a purpose <laughs> And all of you across Canada, welcome to SLXCA, let's make some noise. <laughs> One of the most important things that SLXCA does is, is it brings you together to meet. We hope that you'll all be inspired and, um, and learn a, a, a few things along the way. As David said, I work with an innovation and leadership consultancy. I also spent a long time at uh, emerging technology focused think tank in Silicon Valley. Do I have two? Um, and we strongly believe that the cats are better because they actually are respectful animals of everyone. Have you ever had a cat jump at you and park in the public? I don't think so. We believe that, some of us believe that dogs are better because they're more inclusive to those with allergies. The cat argument was pretty good, so I'm gonna go with the cat jump. <laughs> First of all, it's great to be here. It's, it's a great honor to specifically speaking to students. Uh, just actually, I can see most of the locations. Show of hands, how many self identified group as an entrepreneur? We, we got to just thank all our speakers and everyone who's put this all together. So. Uh, so, we just finished the conference and we have two lovely people here. Hello. Hello. I'm Shania. I go to Waterloo. I'm in Tron. Uh, I'm Lauren, I go to U of T, and I'm in the end. And yeah, yeah, Sai. All right. Well, we talked to the Shopify president. He was really awesome. Yeah. Also, Lauren's MCing was awesome. Daniel, so that was even Lauren, you really absolutely killed it. Shout out to Lauren, guys. She uh, killed MCing today. What is wor uh, words of wisdom or advice for any aspiring true leaders? I would just say keep following what you're interested in, and good things will come of it. And yeah. I love that. Yeah.
yeah, I think you really just have to like put yourself out there and like you cannot like do not let any negative thoughts or like you just gotta go full 100% all the time. And, like if your idea, if people aren't saying that it's like crazy or anything, yeah. then it's like not risque enough. So like just do it, right? Yeah, it. confidence yeah. is key. Yeah, fake yeah. it till you make it. Exactly. Friends, one last time, we have a celebrity on the vlog today. Who are you for the- actually everybody knows you but like just do another introduction. Um, my name is Sarah and I'm a second year computer science student at the University of Waterloo. Just won like a big competition, yeah. like what was that? That was Hack the North, uh, okay. it's the largest hackathon in Canada. I think one of the largest in the world. But um, yeah, my good. team and I, uh, it was myself and then three of my friends in software engineering were all in second year and we decided to build an AR piano. So you put on these Oculus Quest goggles, uh, which takes you into the VR world or AR world. We kind of did like an, a mix of both, mm -hmm. um, but we have a piano right in front of you and you can play it, it'll record your sound, and then you can play it back and then drag and drop your notes. And it's really just for composition purposes. You know, it helps like musicians with composing music and we're all pianists ourselves. So we thought oh, that wow. it would be like a really useful tool for ourselves. Okay, yeah. so I, I play the cello, right? So we can do a collab, like cello okay, okay. piano collab. Oh, it sounds are, yeah. awesome. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, any uh, words of wisdom, advice for aspiring shoe leg leaders? Um, I think that like everyone is obviously doing extracurriculars in high school. People are always telling you to like find your passion and things like that. But I think at the end of the day, in order to like you know, make yourself stand out, you have to be able to express all these things. So I actually took a bunch of creative writing classes and I definitely feel like that helped me with scholarship writing because it's very different from what you'll do in school. Um, so I think, yeah, like focusing on, you know, how to express everything that you've done in like the form of an essay or like a video that you have to send for like a university application or something. I think that's also something that people typically overlook, but it's something that's really important. But I think okay, it, it was a fun, it was a fun event. Say toodles, bye bye!